Hello and good day everyone, it's the Gaming Wife, and welcome back to Paradise Farm and to Stardew Valley. Last episode, we did a lot of fishing and we got a lot of money. We got 5600 and that was after spending 5000 on getting a steel pickaxe. So overall, doing very well. Farming was level 4, mining 4, forging 5, fishing is level 8 now, and combat is level 3. We're probably going to max out fishing before spring is done at the rate that we're going, especially since we need a lot of money and fishing is going to be our big money maker. Weather for today is sunny. Weather for tomorrow. Sunny. Oh, that's right. The flower dance. I should really take a look at the calendar to see if there's anybody's birthdays coming up. Hopefully I didn't miss one yesterday. Spirits are annoyed. Well, that's not good. All right, let's keep at it with some more quartz. All right, go ahead and drop some stuff off. Looking good there. What do we got in the mail? Read an article about you in the local park paper. I'm impressed with your progress. Keep it up. Love, Dad. Well, thank you, Dad. Dear Lily, we're going to be getting together for the flower dance. Arrive between 9 and 2 if you're interested. So here's the thing. Right now, I have absolutely no relationship level with anybody that is an eligible bachelor or a bachelorette to even dance. Because I think you need like four, four hearts to dance with somebody. I don't know if you get relationship boosts just by talking to them at a festival, like in Harvest Moon games you used to. So realistically... I don't know if I want to go to the flower dance this year, just because all I would be doing is going there to dance. Unless Pierre has a shop, um, like he does with all the festivals, in which case I would go just for that reason. And I have to show up between before two, so maybe I'll go just for that reason, but otherwise it's kind of a waste of a day. A day I could be fishing, and fishing is so important right now. <laughs> Oh, I need more water. But yeah, I don't know. I'll have to... I might have to do a little bit of reading on that one just to see if that's the case. If it's worth it or not. We should be getting at least one more harvest of these strawberries before the end of the season. I make, I'll be excited when our ancient fruit comes to fruition and that should be coming up soon for the first one up top because that one I think I planted like the first week and it takes about a whole month so yeah should be coming soon ooh hello you guys are old now yes our first eggs I would like to make a mayonnaise maker, but I'm missing an earth stone. Yeah, I have no earth stones. I have not found any earth crystals. Now that I think about it, I might have to hit up some of the older, or I mean, um, lower, not lower levels of the mine, but some of the um, upper levels of the mine just for that, just to get some earth crystals. I probably would find a bunch in the geodes, but I've been kind of saving the money. <laughs> so that's why I haven't done it. We are going to sell these. When they become larger, I can go ahead and donate them to the community center. But I think as of right now, yeah, it's a regular um, duck egg. But I'll get two large eggs, which will be two. And then I'll go with cows, ducks, and goats. I don't even know if I'm going to go with sheep because I don't think I need their wool for anything. Let's see. That's just money. Lots of money. Field research. I do need to give a, a chub to Demetrius. 
Do, 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 do. Maple syrup for that, but... Yeah. Don't need anything... I mean, there's... The only thing that really requires wool is this animal bundle. But if I'm getting goats anyways, then it's not really worth aiming for the sheep anytime soon. Eventually, I will have sheep. Just, I don't think that's one of the ones I'm gonna, you know, street speed run to. At least not right now. Alright, so... Another day of fishing awaits. But first, let's go check out the community center. Or, I mean, the bulletin board. Clay. Well, clay is handy, I suppose. Ooh, more wormies. A book. Okay. Let's see if there's anybody's birthday coming up. No quest, huh? Alright, so it looks like Pierre and Emily at the end of the week. Uh, let's go in here and see if Caroline's tea bush, if that's got anything. Good morning, Abigail. Will you be dancing tomorrow? Can you can you hurry up? Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's right. It's aerobics today. I forgot about that. It is Tuesday. Oh, you do get one. Oh, darn. I missed out on yesterday then. So... Young leaves of the tea plant can be brewed into a popular energizing beverage. Okay, so it must give you the same side effects, or at least similar side effects as coffee. And what did I need to make my own? Ah, come on. Wild seeds. Okay. Two. Which means that if I were to take a batch of mixed forage, then I should get, like, five because I think you get what 10 when you do that it's either 10 or 30 so at any rate we'll be able to get quite a quite a bit of tea bushes going so that would be nice alrighty we're going to switch it up and head to the lake We went to the beach, we went to the river, but now we're headed to the lake. Using this fine thing. And actually what I'm going to do is drop off this, this, and this. At 2 o'clock the adventure guild opens up. And I would like to sell them some stuff. Plus I think I have like a, a reward that I needed to claim for the grubs. So I'll do that too. Linus! Hello, sir. How are you? I am not coming to ridicule you. I was being nice offering a sweet berry. Jeez. Can't blame Linus, though. He lives a very uh, unique lifestyle out of normal society norm. Alrighty, we got a car, and what else? Bait. Okay, well, that bait just took care of that carp, so that works. We'll keep our eye out for bubbles, but for now, I think we're just going to stand around here for a little while. And I think I'm going to go ahead and try out a new editing technique where I'll just cut to all the different fish or treasure chests that I got. That way you guys don't have to sit around and watch me fish through all the boring parts. So I will show you all of that and cut back to when we venture out to the Adventurers Guild. Alrighty, everybody. So I fished here until my energy was shot till about 5.20. Let's look at what we got here. So, honestly, I did get a few treasure chests, but they were junk. A geode, 
skeletal tail, a little bit of copper, a little bit of coal, and lots of bait, just regular bait. But overall, we got a largemouth bass, only one though, but five chub, we got 12 carp, and five bullheads. So all in all, not too bad for the first session. We're going to take a break. We're going to go visit the Adventurers Guild. I do want to grab my stuffs. Oh, we've got bubbles. Should I, you know what? Never leave bubbles. So we're going to do another short impromptu fishing session. All right. Well, that went a lot farther than I thought it would. We got a lot more stuff, including a rusty spoon, which unfortunately we already had, but we got a few more bullhead, one more bullhead that was silver, and I think we got another one that was uh, better quality. Got four more chubs, regular carp. I got a few more of the nicer carps and a couple more of the nicer chubs. Two more of the largemouth bass, so that was really nice. And I think I got like 10 coal from a treasure chest, so that was pretty darn nice. And I got a quite a few more geodes too. I got seven now. So overall, not too bad. And it actually ended at the perfect time because I think the Adventures Guild closes at 10. So I want to make sure that I sell some stuff. Uh, I am never going to use the slingshot. Plus, I think there's a better slingshot anyways. So if I ever wanted to use it or try my hand at it again, I'll use a better one. Hello, gentlemen. Ooh, you guys got a lot of stuff now. Oh, I can't even sell the slingshot. Well, rings. 2,500. Amethyst ring. No. I would want a new blade. 4,000. Wow. 22 to 29. Well, for half the price, 22 to 29, one defense, or 20 to 32, two defense, a lot less speed though, but 2,000. Hmm. A cutlass or a pirate sword. Oh, those are all pretty cool. Jill, what do you got? An insect head? Level four sword, 10 to 20 damage, two speed, two critical chance. Okay. Huh. I wonder if that's better than what I have now. Probably. Sounds better. Do I have my sword in here or is that at home? It's at home. Okay. That's fine. Well, I'll leave that here. And I'll leave that there. I'll probably try that um, the next time I go in the vines because why not? Uh, Alrighty. So it is 9.30. I'm going to eat up a little bit more. So far we have 5,900 for gold. And how many fish do I have? Let's see. 4, 5, 6, 15, 23, 24, 31, 35, 38. Oh! Sebastian, hold on. Hello. Hello. Ugh, tomorrow's the worst festival of the year by a mile. Just wait and see how stupid I look during the flower dance. <laughs> I've never actually seen that dialogue before. That's hilarious. See, this is why I'm going to marry you, Sebastian, because <laughs> you're funny. <laughs> oh. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and, you guessed it, fish for the rest of the night. So I will bring you guys back when it is time to head home. Alrighty, everybody. I am out of energy. It is one o'clock. It is about time to head back home. I did get a couple treasure chests along the way. Got another Nautilus, Nautilus fossil. And I got another skeletal tail. And then that was pretty much about it when it came to treasure, besides some more bait. Our end result for fishing we've got five, eight, nine. 22, 30, 31, 36, 44, 48, 51 fish. 
that should give us quite the pretty penny. I'm actually really excited. I can't wait to see how much we get in the end. Not too bad. Lots of money. Whoop, oh, ahead here. And we also got ourselves a new weapon. That's pretty exciting. Alrighty. We're gonna throw it all in the bin. I only need to keep one. I think I brought the, the others inside the house. Um, I only have enough for one copper. So let's grab one of those. Two of those. Put that in there. Put that in there. Tomorrow. Tomorrow I need to make some mixed seeds and start doing some some tea leaf. Tea bushes. Alright, so let's do this and this. Get in there. Good night, Poppy. Sleep. Alright. Level 9 fishing. Sea foam pudding. That must be a new recipe. I don't remember sea foam pudding the last time I played. Alright, grand total. 5381. Breaking it down, let's see here. The ooh, the iridium chubs were 125. Largemouth bass were 187. The iridium bullhead were the same as the largemouth bass. That's interesting. The bullheads were actually quite profitable. And the chubs weren't too bad either. Alright. So that means that we have over 10,000 gold. Perfect. <laughs> Wonderful. We are at 11,000 gold. Sweet. So we already know what we're going to be doing. We're going to get that upgraded chicken coop. Oh, I can't. Today's the flower festival. Darn. All right. Well, that's okay. That just means that we'll, we'll get some more money today. Yeah. Okay. So I'm actually going to go ahead and leave the episode here. I know after I cut out a lot of the fishing, it's going to be a shorter episode. Uh, one of the suggestions that was presented to me was to maybe cut my episodes shorter. So I'm going to give that a shot and you guys can let me know what you like. If you prefer the 25, 30 minute long episodes or if you prefer them to be shorter. Or if you prefer them to be longer or if I should do a mix and match. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. Uh, like the episode if you did enjoy it and ring, select that uh, subscribe button if you want to be notified about future episodes. Thank you guys for watching and have a wonderful day.